73 horsepower, huh? Check that out. Uh-huh. Absolutely. Put that stuff on Facebook Live. That's some cool stuff. All right. So this 259D, we've got a handful of things we're going to talk about here. We're going to talk about its ability to have two speed. It has creeper control. It's also a vertical lift design, which means that bucket stays parallel throughout the entire lifting cycle. Gives you more ability to reach your truck. Better ability for uh, keeping your outfitter safe in the cab. Speaking of outfitters, i got Eric Esposito. He's one of Caterpillar's demonstrating instructors. He's demonstrating this machine. Well, I thought he was. Speedo, right? You know what? They say what happens in Vegas stems in Vegas. I hope they don't have to leave an operator here. I just had to go for the good view, Chad. Uh -huh. I got a view up top over here. Up in the crow's nest. Check everybody out. See what's going on. That's awesome, buddy. Well, I tell you what, Eric Esposito, he's a gifted operator, but even a dummy like myself can run this thing. This is a remote task system that we have available on 16 different B-Series Caterpillar models. You can get it a skid steer, an MTL, or a CTL. And if those acronyms don't mean anything to you, I encourage you to go talk to your local dealer. They can explain exactly what that means. You know what this thing does? Well, look at that. You can do anything. You can honk the horn. I guess he's getting tired of me talking. You can honk the horn. You can drop the bucket. You can run hydromechanical work tools. So let's say, for example, you work alongside of a busy interstate. You don't want to put your outboard in harm's way. You can run the creeper control. You can run your mill head. You can run your saw head. Whatever you need to run, you can do it via this remote task system. Now I'm going to walk down here real quick, if you guys don't mind. Excuse me, sir. Mind if I squeeze in here real quick? So I'm going to walk down here real quick, get a little bit closer to this machine. And you notice that Speedo, he just dropped the bucket, picked up the set of forks, and he's ready to go. No interface from an operator, no interface from a labor. Nice, safe sound. It's an excellent system. So, safety. That's obviously, it's paramount. We say uh, at Caterpillar, we say safety is no accident. So you notice that there's a green light flashing. So that green light, it lets me know that we've got connectivity, but the orange or the amber light, it actually stopped blinking. So that tells me as a laborer or a pedestrian that Speedo has acknowledged that I need to get close to the machine, so he has locked out the hydraulics. Extremely safe. You saw Speedo walking down those steps, and let's say he was out late last night, which he wasn't, but let's say he was and he fell down the steps, right? When that remote task system, when the council tilts more than 45 degrees, it locks the hydraulics, it locks the parking brake, and it brings your idle down to a low, low idle, keeping you nice, safe, and sound. At any point in time, if Speedo is concerned about the safety of either the machine or the people around it, he has an e-stop, a big red button. You can hit that button, it'll actually shut it down. Very, very safe system. So, I can talk about it all day long. I like to talk, but I need some operators. Who here is an operator? Anybody? Right here. Right here. Right here. We got, Dad, we got one right here. We got our oh. first one. All right. We got Carson coming up. Carson. Jump up there, Carson. Carson, are you an operator? Yeah. Yep. What does that mean? How many years? Yeah. I got a steak knife, but Three I'm years. not a surgeon. How many? Three years. Three years. All right. So, Carson, we're going to ask him to pick up the basketball. You might notice it's a caterpillar basketball. He's going to pick it up, move it from one cone to the next using the remote task system. So the 259D has infinitely variable controllability on the machine, but you also have that from the remote task system. Very safe, very precise. It's a good system. Now, I can be in here because Speedo's got, he's got my back, so to speak. He can hit that e-stop if at any point in time things do not feel safe. So Carson's going to pick up this ball. I have complete confidence in him. And assuming he does it successfully, we're going to give him a Caterpillar hat. And to be honest with you, this is a safe zone. So even if he messes it up, we're going to give him a hat anyway. Yeah. So as he's doing that, let's talk about that big trailer behind Carson there. So that trailer, it houses a command for dozing system that we have. So on our D8, our D10, and our D11, you can run them remote control as well, or you can take it one next step farther and run a machine that's in Peoria, Illinois, from that trailer right now. Real time, excellent visibility. Oh my, look at Carson. Hey, hey. All right, excellent job.